In this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix Xbox controller not connecting to PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you several reasons on why your Xbox controller might not be connecting to your PC and how to go about fixing them. So, one of the simplest ways to fix any issues attributed to your Xbox controller not connecting to your PC is to simply try a different cable or a connection method. So first, if you are trying to connect it wirelessly, you are going to have to ensure that you have Bluetooth capabilities enabled on your PC, meaning that if you don't have a Bluetooth adapter, Bluetooth is not going to be working. So you can try connecting it through a cable, so a wired connection, and if you are currently using a wired connection and it doesn't work, then you can try exchanging the cable or switching to wireless. Regardless, Another thing to check if you want to do it wirelessly is to go over to the Bluetooth and devices on your Windows PC and go into the devices option where you can click the button to add a device and then select Bluetooth. If you do not have a Bluetooth adapter on your computer like me, then you are going to get this message. So if you get this message, this means that you either have to buy an external USB Bluetooth adapter or you will have to use a cable in the meantime. Keep that in mind, if your computer does not have Bluetooth capabilities, you aren't going to be able to connect the Xbox controller wirelessly. With this out of the way, the next thing to check is to right click the Windows icon and in here go over to the Device Manager. As you can see, I have my Xbox 360 controller under this. If you have a newer modern controller, it might be under a different name, but regardless, just find the peripheral or the controller listed here somewhere. If you are able to find it here, but it is not working when you go inside of a game, then what you can try to do is right click this and then select update driver. Let Windows search automatically for drivers until this process is complete. See if it works. And if it still doesn't work, the next thing that I would recommend is to right click this and then either uninstall the device or disable the device. Afterwards, unplug it and then switch the connection method or change the USB ports. So if you have it on one of the available USB ports on your computer, try a different one. Immediately upon connecting the controller into a different USB port, the drivers should get recognized and downloaded right away. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Xbox controller not connected to PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.